So for our prayer cast during Holy Week, we're exploring the Stations of the Cross that were created by members of the Congregation of Grace. And this one is on betrayal. There are many painful stories that we have to confront during Holy Week. And one of the ones that is the most painful to me is Judas's betrayal of Jesus, not just because he betrays his rabbi, his teacher, his friend, but because he betrays him with a kiss, such an intimate and loving symbol that he uses as an indicator of who should be put in chains and taken away to be executed. It is a heart-wrenching story. And so this year, as we explore these stories of Jesus' last week on earth, they are also being paired with issues that we are dealing with in our world, issues of social justice. And so for tonight's um, social justice station of the cross, we're looking at immigration. And this is a station that was created by Mike and Stein Altman. Um, Stein wove these different pieces here and Mike wrote a reflection to go with them. These weavings can be prayer mats. They can be the prayer mats of the Muslims kept out. They can be the prayer mats of the Muslims who are here, but looked upon with suspicion, hatred, and doubt. These weavings can be blankets. They can be blankets for the cold beds and detention centers. They can be soft blankets for those who are caught in the concrete and steel of our immigration system. These weavings can be welcome mats. They can be mats, mats we put out to welcome everyone. They can be mats that say, you belong here, where we can live lives woven together with love. And so as we think about welcome as we think about betrayal and denial i wonder what questions you might need to ask yourself what questions we may need to ask ask ourselves are we only welcoming of immigrants when they provide services and things that we need or want or things that make our lives better but then do we turn around and betray them when all they want are the simple rights that you and i have Tonight, I hope you will reflect on what it means to welcome fully, to embrace fully. I wonder what you will think about when you think about these mats. May God go with you this night, and may you know the fullness, the depth of God's love and welcome for you. Amen.